It is one of the most highly anticipated sports events in Colorado. It has nothing to do with the Broncos, but it has everything to do with Sports Authority Field at Mile High. We're talking about the Rocky Mountain Showdown. It has been played here for years. Now there's word this morning that it could disappear. Well, this could really disappoint a lot of football fans. Take a look. Our partners at the Boulder Daily Camera first reporting this, and it's a showdown of a different kind. It's between the athletic directors of both CU and CSU over where the game should be played. CU's athletic director, Rick George, on the left claims one school wants to keep playing in Denver while the other university wants to bring it back to campus. He, he won't say who wants that, but CSU's interim athletic director, John Morris, is on the right there. So Rick George telling the Boulder Daily Camera that after 2020, when the current series contract ends, he doesn't plan on scheduling any more games against CSU. And that would end quite a rivalry matchup with a lot of history. It stretches back more than 120 years. The first showdown, get this, was back in 1893. It was discontinued for a while, starting in 1958, but came back strong. Even though CU lost last year, they've dominated the series, winning 72.6% of the games. And for the games to continue in 2020, apparently both universities are going to have some venue negotiations to talk about before the games go on. We'll have to wait and see. We've got plenty of time, about six years. I'm Eric Lufa, 7 News Now.